Yo, 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 what's good, what's good, what's good everybody, Beat Economy 200, about to get started, shout out to all the producers out here early in the chat, what up to everybody, uh, my name is Clifton, we're gonna both, we about to get this battle started, it's gonna be another crazy night, we got eight dope producers lined up, they all got their beats ready to go, so we're gonna get this popping off, we're not gonna waste too much time, but first and foremost, shout out to everybody out there, shout out to eight producers tonight, we got Levy Beats in the building, we got Lincoln, we got Diverse, we got The Man With Many Styles, Kane Caleb, we got Uncommon, The Unspoken Truth, and Crush. So, it's a dope lineup for tonight. Shout out to everybody. It's going to be crazy. For those who are new to the platform, don't know how to vote, it's exclamation vote space one or exclamation vote space two. If you don't know, I'm sure someone in the chat will fill you in, but that's basically how it goes down. So, there's eight producers tonight, three rounds, best of three. Um... Yeah, best of three all, all through. Hopefully hopefully we don't get too many ties like we've been getting in the last little while. Um, you know, we just want to keep everything in order. Three beats per round. Um, so with that said, with that being said, shout out to all the all the cities, all the countries, everybody represented. Cali, Virginia Beach, um, shout out to South Carolina, South Dakota, New York, New Hampshire, Botswana, shout out to United Kingdom, Toronto. Um, everybody, the U.S., Canada, U.K., Europe, Russia, Africa, India, everybody, Australia, South America, Caribbean, you already know what it is. So, without any further ado, we're just going to jump right into it. Everybody who jumps on late, you know, they could jump in when they jump in and vote when they vote. But for right now, we're just going to get it started. So, without any further ado, let's just get right into this. First up, we got Crush versus The Unspoken Truth. The drill, if you don't know, is 60 seconds per beat, after which time we go to the polls. And in the polls, you just put exclamation vote space one for producer number one or exclamation vote space two for producer number two. And that's the drill for the whole night. Simple as that. You hear the beat, you pick which beat you like, and you vote for that beat. If you don't vote correctly, it doesn't count. So you got to make sure you vote exactly that way. Exclamation, vote, a space, and then number one or number two. Anything other than that, it doesn't count. And the producer that you might want to win doesn't win because you voted incorrectly. Every single vote counts. All it takes is one vote to sway or make a tie or break a tie. So every single vote counts. So without any further ado, let's get into it. Crush versus the unspoken truth. Crush is going up first, 60 seconds. Let's see if you crush this or not. You niggas taking a chance being in Long Beach, though, Jack. <laughs> I saw the police had some brother jacked up when we was coming in here. Niggas hands way up here. Talking about, huh? What? They're searching the ship, but they take him away to jail. Go to jail in Long Beach is a motherfucker. So that is the opening beat. We opening on a mellow note tonight, but that's just the first beat, you know. Anything can happen. So we start now with the with the with the mellow vibe from Crush. Let's see what the unspoken truth has to say about that. 60 seconds unspoken truth. Let's get it. Your walls, let some light in. Yeah. All 
right, so we are definitely starting out on a mellow vibe tonight, but it's all good. Um, that's how it goes. A beat is a beat. If it's dope, it's dope. Don't matter if it's fast, slow, hard, you know, mellow, melodic, whatever the case may be. But without any further ado, we're going to go to the polls. You guys are going to tell us who got that first round. Crush or the unspoken truth? Exclamation vote space one for crush. Exclamation vote space two for unspoken truth. Um, polls are now open. Get your vote in. Anybody who is tuning in for the first time, this is Beat Economy 200. We have eight producers from around the world battling for $200 cash. Every battle is a different cash prize. Sometimes it's 200, sometimes it's 500, sometimes it's a thousand. This Thursday, this Sunday, uh, is a thousand dollars battle going down. Of course, we got three judges for that battle. If you tuned in for the last one thousand, you know the judges are ready. Too rude, why not? And um, Millennius from Tone Mason. So that will be a uh, beat economy one thousand, and one thousand is the cash prize. The spots are all filled up for that one. Uh, we'll open the spots up for the following battle, which will be end of August, early September. So if anybody still wants to get into one thousand popping that off but there is a beat economy 500 going down on august the 16th so if you want to jump in that and that one is at 2 p.m eastern standard so if you're overseas it's a little better timing for you but anyway we're done with round one and producer number one makes his way through so just to show you a mellow beat can do it but let's go to round two or i should say beat number two still in the first round crush let's see what a second beat sounds like 60 seconds crush let's get it So that's the second beat from Crush. Took a while to get in the vibe to feel the pocket. But it's just dope. It's dope. Different, but dope. Uh, let's see what the unspoken truth has to say in response to that. 60 seconds unspoken truth. Let's go. <laughs> So that's the second beat from the unspoken truth to sound like someone who really wants to go to a round three with that beat. So we're going to find out if that is the case or not. Let's go to the polls. Exclamation vote space one for crush. Exclamation vote space two for the unspoken truth. Polls are now open. Get your vote in. Um, see who's going to if this is going to be a clean sweep or we go into a round three. I suspect it's going to go to a round three, but I could be wrong. It's all up to y'all. Once again, this is Beat Economy 200. $200 is the cash price tonight. The producers are battling for the $200 bag tonight. 
This is best of three, so all rounds tonight are best of three. Lose one round, you always got that chance to come back and redeem yourself. But for right now, we got about 20 seconds left on the polls. Once again, exclamation vote space one for crush, exclamation vote space two for the unspoken truth. 10 seconds to go. See if we're going to go to a round three or is this the end of the road right here? It's all good either way. We go to round three. It's all good. But let's see. Producer number two gets it. The unspoken truth has spoke his truth and redeemed himself. So we are going to a round three. Crush is going first. Let's see who's going to break this 1-1 this one, one win and see who's going to take it for the best of three. So Crush going first. 60 seconds. Let's get it. Alright, 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 crush. Coming to crush the competition. Let's see if that was enough to do just that. Some people feeling the tuba. Sounded a little busy at, at certain points, but you know, it is what it is. That was the beat from Crush. So let's see what the unspoken truth has to say in response to that. Let's see if we're going to end this round three situation. Hopefully we're not going to a round four. But shit happens as everybody knows. Sometimes we go to a round four in the first first round. But um, third beat from the unspoken truth. Let's do it. So that is the third and final beat for the first round from the unspoken truth. Let's go to the polls and see how this is going to play out. Who's making it to the top four tonight? One of these producers are making it into the top four. And one step closer to getting the bag. So let's go to the polls. Exclamation vote space one for crush. Exclamation vote space two for the unspoken truth. Polls are now open. Do the right thing. Get your vote in. Make it count. Some people saying they got that primo vibe to it. Maybe so, maybe so. I wasn't getting a strong primo vibe, but I guess it was kind of going in that direction. I wasn't getting a, you know, a straight boom bat primo vibe, but I guess with the loop, with the loop kind of style, I, I get it. Um, Quentin Tarantino intro. All right, so 30 seconds left on the polls, and we're going to see who's taking this one. Crush got the first one. The Unspoken Truth got the second one. So this will determine who's going to make it to the top four. We got about 15 seconds left on the polls. Once again, this is Beat Economy 200. $200 is the cash prize. And whoever wins this round might be one of the, might be the winner. Or at least one step closer to the, to the bag. So three, two, one. 
polls are now closed. Producer number two comes back from being one down and takes the second and third round. So he will be making his way onto the top four. The Unspoken Truth is heading into the top four. Salute to Crush. The first time on the platform. And like I always say, usually the first time you got to just feel the environment out, feel the terrain, see what the, what, the, what the viewers are feeling, what they're not feeling. Take some constructive criticism. Come back the next time and do it up. You know, that's how it usually goes. Everybody takes a loss sometimes before they take a win. So it is what it is. Shout out to Crush doing his thing. Shout out to the Unspoken Truth. Make it into the top four. And with that said, we're going to move right along. We got some uh, old uh, Beat Economy veterans, I'd say. Uncommon, Kane, Caleb. So let's see what they got in store. They've been, they've been battle tested. They know what the drill already is. So let's see what they got in store. We're going to start with Uncommon. He's going to be the first producer of 60 seconds. So let's get it in. Uh, Uncommon first beat, 60 seconds. Let's do it. Maybe we should have started that as the first round just to give that energy to set it off. But it's all good. It's all good. Um, anybody who's having issues, I hear some people having issues on Twitch. Well, luckily, unlike the last battle, unfortunately, the last battle wasn't recorded, but this battle is being recorded. So whatever you don't catch live today, you can catch it uh, after the fact. It'll be on Twitch. It'll be on YouTube. We'll put it on YouTube tomorrow. So for the people who are accustomed to YouTube, it'll be uploaded tomorrow on YouTube. So hopefully you can get it clearly tonight but if not then as a backup you can check it out tomorrow on youtube battle of the beatmakers tv so that was the opening beat from uncommon dope which is not uncommon it's common which used we're used to hearing dope from uncommon and let's see what came caleb has once again king caleb is a three-time champ but none of that matters tonight it's about what you bring tonight to the table so first beat king caleb let's get it So that is the response for uh, Kane Caleb starting a little mellow, a little mellower than we're used to, but still dope. As I said, it doesn't always have to be bang, bang, bang to be a dope, a dope beat. So that's the first opening round from Uncommon and Kane Caleb. Let's go to the, to the polls and see what you guys think about that first opening round. Um, polls are now open. Exclamation vote space one for Uncommon. Exclamation vote space two for Kane Caleb. I see how this is going to play out. And by all means, if you're in the battle, vote for yourself. Why not? Shout out to Benny D in the chat. Shout out to all the producers in the building tonight. Whether you're in the battle or just, just stopping by to see what's going on.
Yeah, some people have been technical. If you can't hear us, um, I'm not sure. I mean, some people, people are voting, so they're obviously hearing something or they wouldn't be voting randomly. So you can put it in the chat if you're if you're um, having issues or not. But the beats are being being streamed. So again, if you don't catch it right now, we'll be uploading it tomorrow on YouTube so you can catch it from scratch all over again. But um, this round is over and producer number two takes the first one. So shout out to Kane Caleb. He got the first one, but it's not over yet. Uncommon always has something in the stash. Second beat from Uncommon, 60 seconds. Let's get it. That was the second beat from Uncommon, but I'm hearing some issues with the polls. So let's just let's just take this back from the start. Let's go back to the beginning of this round. Uncommon versus Kane Caleb. Everybody in the chat, just let me know if you had a chance to correctly or even to vote. Let me just say if you had a chance to vote. Um got people overseas in the UK, they're getting it fine. Uh let us know in the chat. If you had a chat, if you're hearing this clearly and you've had no issues voting and whatnot, you're getting everything on time, let us know. We just keep it moving. But if we are having issues, then we could pull that round up again. The first round, Uncommon and Kane Caleb. All right, so everybody's getting it all good. All right, so that was the second beat from Uncommon. Let's get into the second beat from Kane Caleb. 60 seconds, Kane, let's see what you got. So that was the second beat from Kane Caleb. Um, hopefully everybody heard that. I know some people are having some issues with Wi-Fi or Twitch. Technical stuff. It's We're in a technical world. Things happen. But hopefully you heard enough to decide who you think was who had the better beat for that round. Um, I'm going to open the polls in a few seconds. If there is a delay, then, you know, you still have time to get it in. But uh, I'm going to open the polls in about few actually we're gonna open the polls right now so exclamation vote space one for uncommon exclamation vote space two for kane caleb hopefully you all hearing this with enough time to get it in and make sure you vote correctly exclamation vote space one exclamation vote space two um both beats were dope both producers are dope you know they just both dope they both they both got their shit together so shout out to uncommon shout out to kane caleb but in a battle, only one person can be left standing. So one of these two producers are making it to the top four. We're going to find out if it's a clean sweep or we go into a round three. But in advance, however it goes, just know both producers are dope. 
I think some of you, I think both of them are in the 1000. I might be mistaken, but I think they're both in the 1000, which would be dope. So you get to see how you're judged by your peers and you get to see how you're judged by actual judges. So that's the true determination. You know what I mean? When you get both sides of the coin. But we're down to the last three seconds of this round. From what I can see, everybody's voting. Everybody's not having no issues voting. And producer number two takes it. Kane Caleb uh, returns doing his thing. Shout out to Uncommon. Both beats, in my opinion, were extremely dope. So I would have loved to see this go to a round three. Because I'm sure, without a shadow of a doubt, you had something crazy for the second round. Something ridiculous for the third round. So shout out to the Uncommon doing his thing as always. Shout out to Kane Caleb moving on to the top four. Um, so you guys can talk amongst yourself about how everything is sounding, if you guys are getting everything clearly or not. I see everybody voting, so I guess everything is cool. You know, there might be a little delay here and there, but, um, you know, with technology, shit happens. Shout out to everybody who's joining us a little late, but um, still enough time to tune in and see what's what, see who's who, see what's hot, see what's not, get your vote in. Um, once again, this is Beat Economy 200. On Saturday, we got Beat Economy 1000 going down. So 16 producers already locked and loaded, ready to go. Three judges, um, two rude. Why not from Soundsmith and um, my man Millennials from Tone Mason. So they, they'll be getting ready for that battle. So let's keep it moving. Uh, up next, we got the man with many styles going against Diverse. So... Uh, the man with many styles has been in the battle a few times, so he already knows the drill. For those that don't know the drill, 60 seconds each beat, after which time we go to the polls, exclamation vote space one for producer number one, or exclamation vote space two for producer number two. Um, anybody who wants to battle, jump in the battle. You have to go on the site, battleofthebeatmakers.com. All the information is on the site, battleofthebeatmakers.com. Um, you can also register to IG, just go to our IG channel, World Beat Battle, and you can go to the um, link in the bio and register that way. So either way, through IG or through directly on the site, battleofthebeatmakers.com, get it in, get your beats up, get your money up. And you might walk home with 200 bucks, 500 bucks, or 1000 whichever battle you jump in. So without any further ado, let's get into it. The, un, the man with many styles, 60 seconds, first beat, let's go. with many styles first beat right out the gate always showing his diversity originality creating his own lane diverse uh interesting matchup the man with many styles against diverse so they both should be out of you know out of the normal out of the out of the box so let's see what diverse has to say 60 seconds let's get it <laughs> Definitely diverse. I thought the beat was over at the dropout point, but um, 
Diverse. I like that. These guys are a good matchup. Just the names alone. The man with many styles versus Diverse. That's dope. So let's go to the polls and, and let's figure out who had the better styles or who was more diverse. Exclamation vote space one for the man with many styles. Exclamation vote space two for diverse. Polls are now open. Do the right thing. Get your vote in. Make it count. Help one of these young or older producers get through. See who's going to make it to the top four. See who's going get, to get the bag tonight. Every battle, someone gets a bag. As I said, 200, 500, or as it is this Sunday, it will be 1,000 on the line. So if you're interested in battling, if you think you got what it takes, put your money where your mouth is. Battle of the Beatmakers is the website to hit up and get your vote in, get your beats in, get it going. So we got about 30 seconds left on the polls. Uh, exclamation vote space one for the man with many styles. Exclamation vote space two for diverse. And if you're a producer in the battle, by all means, vote for yourself if you think you had the better beat. Ain't nothing wrong with that. So, 10 seconds left on the polls. As we wind down, we got one more matchup for the first round, and then we're going to be into the top four. So, this round is closed, and producer number two gets the first one diverse. Uh, maybe it was that drop off, that drop out that got everybody. But however it goes, um, yeah, that's what it is. Diverse got the first one, but it's not over yet. So the man with many styles, second beat, 60 seconds. Let's get it. <laughs> So that was the second beat from the man with many styles. He dipped into a different chamber for that one. He had to dig into a different bag for that second beat. Dope. People wanted to hear the whole beat. And unfortunately, or fortunately, that was the whole beat. That's what the whole submission was. So it wasn't nothing. Of, it wasn't a matter of us cutting it off. That's what the submission was. Now, rightfully so, we asked producers to submit 60 seconds of the beat. Sometimes they sent three minutes. Sometimes they sent a minute and 20 seconds. So, you know. Depending on the vibe, sometimes we let it run for an extra 10 seconds or whatever. But in this case, it was exactly that, 60 seconds. So that's all you get from the man with many styles. But if you're really feeling what you like, hit him up. He's in the chat. Any producer that you're, you're effing with, just hit them up directly. Collab, connect, reach out, holler at them. You know, get something popping. So with that being said, we're going to jump into the second producer who goes by the name of Diverse. Second beat, 60 seconds. Let's see how diverse he is. See if he got enough diversity to get through to the top four or not. Let's get it. So that was the second beat from Diverse. Those little dropouts every here and then is is interesting. That adds a little oomph to it. Surprisingly, that little dropout does add some kind of, you know, like an emphasis to the beat. So 
it's dope. It's diverse, I guess. You know, he's living up to his name, just like the man with many styles lives up to his name. Has many different chambers that he can tap into. So, people are fucking with this round. Pardon my French if you're a minor, but people are feeling this round, this matchup. So, let's go to the polls and see how you really, really feel with where you put your vote at. Um, exclamation vote space one is for the man with many styles. Exclamation vote space two for diverse. Polls are now open. Do the right thing. Get your vote in. Make it count. Vote for the better beat. And let one of these young gentlemen get through to the top four. Either way it goes, one of them is going to the top four. But you have the power to decide the fate of how that plays out. So, you got about 40 seconds to do. Um, exclamation vote space one for the man with many styles. Digging into all the different bags, the different chambers that he got stashed away. And diverse. Dropping out. Psyching you out, coming back with another beat or a switch up or the same beat, you know, just throwing a little drop out just to throw you off for a minute. So let's see how this plays out. We got less than 20 seconds left. Once again, this is Beat Economy 200. One of these producers will be walking home with the bag. That's what they're battling here for tonight. Um, shout out to all the producers in the battle. And we are about five seconds away to see... A this is the end of the road, or are we going to a round three? It would be dope to go to a round three, but it's not up to me. Producer number one gets that one. So the man with many styles has redeemed himself. Dipping into the different chambers was all it took to get him through. So we go into a round three, and uh, the man with many styles is opening up. I can only imagine he's going to dip into another chamber. Come up with some other fire. So this is the third beat from the man with many styles. 60 seconds. Let's get it. Shout out to Levy Beats. I like that. There's a sound. There's that Eric B and Rakim paid in full sample in there. And strangely, I was just listening to Eric B and Rakim earlier today. The younger heads might not know anything about Eric B and Rakim, but if you know hip hop thoroughly, you know who Eric B and Rakim is. And that's exactly what that took my mind to just hearing that impeach the president snare in there. So shout out to the man with many styles. As I said, he's always dipping into a different chamber. And I know for sure he knows who Eric B and Rakim is. So it is what it is. Diverse. Let's see what you got. If you can match what we just heard. Because I was feeling what the man with many styles was bringing to the table. Very dope. Very dope. But you're diverse. So let's see if you can hang. So just when you thought you've seen all the tricks and all the dropouts, he actually dropped out and didn't come back with it. But that's what it is. That was the third beat. We might have to call Diverse the man with the bag of tricks because you never know when he's going to drop out and come back with it. That time he didn't bring anything back, but the beat was still dope. Still enough to get through. So let's see if it was enough to get through the whole round, make it to the top four. This is 
uh, the tiebreaker right now. It's one apiece for the man with many styles, one for diverse. This will break that tie situation, and one of these two producers will be making it to the top four. So, polls are open. Get your vote in. Do the right thing. Vote for the better beat. Exclamation vote space one for the man with many styles. Exclamation vote space two for diverse. Let's see how this is going to play out. One of these producers are definitely going to the top four. Yeah, as I said, man, that 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 man with the many styles beat, that's definitely some Rock Kim. Eric B and Rock Kim paid in full vibe. 80, 80, 87, 88, 86. Some of you might not have been born back then. But if you are or were born back then, you definitely know what Eric B and Rock Kim, the legacy they left behind. You know, giving birth to the Nas's, to the J. Coles, to the Kendricks, to the Eminems, a lot of people that came after that. That style, that that blueprint that they set back in the 80s. So it's dope that producers tap into that sound and bring it up to the modern times. It's always dope. So this round is done. Polls are closed. And that paid in full sample took him over the edge. Shout out to the man with many styles. He will be joining us in the top four tonight. Shout out to Diverse. Always bringing that different, you know, that bag of tricks. You never know what's going to come after that dropout. But it's dope nevertheless. Um, shout out to both producers. So, um, the man with many styles doing his thing, diverse doing his thing. Shout out to both of y'all. The man with many styles joining us for the top four tonight. So we got one more matchup to round off top uh, the first round, and then we're gonna move into the top four, which again will be best of three. But the final matchup for this round is three-time champ Lincoln. I guess he knocked off the Crux. Now he's just Lincoln, but we all know who Lincoln is. We already know what he comes with. He already got that bag, um, got that, got that, got that, you know, he already got his pocket, you know. So Levy Beats, let's see what you got to say. Lincoln, let's see what you got to say. Lincoln is going to go first. 60 seconds, first beat. Let's get it. So that is the opening beat from Lincoln starting off mellow. But I knew if that beat went a little bit longer, you'd probably hear something else added to it. Add some, you know, different dimension to it. But it's dope. Dope opening round. First beat, taking it kind of mellow just to start it off, just to get the engines revved up. But Levy Beats, let's see what you got to say in response to that. You got 60 seconds. Let's see if you got enough to take the first round or not. 60 seconds. Let's get it.
All right, so that was the first opening round from, as somebody said, LA versus LB. Lincoln or Crux versus Levy Beats. Let's see what the polls think. Is it LA or LB? Is it Los Angeles or is it Long Beach? Let's find out. Uh, 60 seconds on the polls. Polls are now open. Vote for the better beat. Let the better producer make it to the top four. Exclamation vote space one is for Lincoln or Crux. Exclamation vote space two is for Levy Beats. One of these two producers are going to make it on to the top four, and your votes are going to make that happen. Shout out to all the producers in the chat. Whether you're a producer or not, you're just checking the vibe out. It's all good. Study the competition. That's a wise move. And when you're ready to jump in, you already know what the terrain is like, what the battlefield is looking like. And you know what to hit them with. So we got about 20 seconds left on the polls. If uh, you're joining in late, this is Beat Economy 200. I am your host, Clifton. Um, we got $200 on the line tonight. And one of these producers, one of these remaining producers will be walking home with the bag, which is $200. We also got Beat Economy 1000 coming up this Sunday, August 9th. So make sure you tuned into that 8 p.m. EST. Um, but the voting, the polls are closed. And producer number two takes the first one. So Long Beach gets the first round, but it's not over yet. L.A. still has a chance to redeem himself. 60 seconds, Lincoln, let's get it. So that was the second beat from Lincoln. Benny D saying it sounded like a music video at a carnival. That's dope. As long as a, if a beat gives you a visual, I think that's dope. The fact that it gave you a visual. So um, some people saying they got that Travis Scott vibe. That's dope. If a beat can give you a visual, then that's probably, you know, they said picture paints a thousand words. So I can only imagine what a beat does. A beat gives you that kind of vibe. That's dope. But so shout out to LA calling him Los Angeles for tonight. Uh, let's see what Long Beach has to say in response to that. Lincoln the Crux and Levy Beats. But for tonight, it's LA versus LB. So, Long Beach's turn. Second beat, 60 seconds. Let's get it. So that was the second beat from Levy Beats. Uh, hopefully that took your mind somewhere as well. It's dope when a beat does that to me. That took my mind somewhere. I'm not sure where it took me, but it definitely took me kind of just daydreaming. My mind was just kind of zoning for a minute. So I like that. I like both beats. Both beats were fire. But it's not up to me to, to decide or to vote. Um, 
y'all in the chat are going to vote so you guys are going to determine is this going to go to a round three or we ending this right here or is it going to be one apiece exclamation vote space one is for lincoln otherwise known as la los angeles or exclamation vote space two for levy beats otherwise known as lb long beach so polls are going to be open polls are open now get your vote in make it count do the right thing vote for the better beat not because he's repping Long Beach or he's repping L.A. or he's L.A. or he's L.B. Just vote for the better beat and let the better producer move forward to the top four. So far, we got the unspoken truth. Kane Caleb, the man with many styles in the top four. So one of these two gentlemen will be joining them to round it off. Best of three until we get down to the best of two. Until we get down to the winner. Until we get down to $200. Add it to his bank account, add it to his stash, add it to his, his pocket, you know, reinvest that back into the 1000 turn that into $1,000. That's that's the psychology of it all. You start off with 25 bucks, you get into Beat Economy 200 you win $200, you take half of that, throw it into the 1000 you win 1000 and you just went from $25 to $1,000 in a matter of four hours of battling, in a matter of 16 beats. So, polls are closed, and Levy Beats takes that one. Clean sweep, going to the top four. Shout out to Lincoln the Crooks. Um, he didn't get it through tonight, but Lincoln will be back. Lincoln is going to be in the 1,000 coming up on Sunday. So, if you want to hear some more of Lincoln the Crooks representing that L.A., representing Botswana, but we calling them L.A. for tonight. Lincoln will be back on Sunday, Beat Economy 1,000. So, stay tuned and look forward, and you can look forward to that battle. But for right here, Beat Economy 200, Levy Beats is moving on to the top four. So shout out both producers. It would have been dope to go to a round three just to hear what they had. Um, you know, I'd love to hear what, what else Lincoln had. But as I said, if you want to hear what more they got, check it out on Sunday. Beat Economy 1000 is going down. So Levy Beach is moving into the top four. And we're just going to jump right into the top four. Without any further ado, The Unspoken Truth versus Kane Caleb. 60 seconds, you already know the drill. Let's start with the unspoken truth going first. 60 seconds, first beat of the second round. Let's go. So that was the first beat, second round from the Unspoken Truth. Got that exhibit sample in there. Really dope. I do believe it's exhibit. You could correct me if I'm wrong, but it sounded like Mr. Pimp My Ride to me. So shout out to uh, the Unspoken Truth for dropping that. Let's see what Kane Caleb has, to, has in the stash. Uh, his first beat for the second round. 60 seconds. Let's get it.
Yes, the fire that we've come to expect from Cain, in it. That is the fire we come to expect from Cain. Uh, shout out to the Unspoken Truth. Both beats were dope. Let's go to the polls and see if that exhibit sample was enough to get Unspoken Truth through. Or is that UK drill enough to get Cain Caleb through? 60 seconds on the polls. Exclamation vote space one for the Unspoken Truth. Exclamation vote space two for Cain Caleb. Polls are now open. Do the right thing. Vote for the better beat. And let's see who's going to make it to the finals tonight. So we're down to the top four. One of these gentlemen will be making the, the finals. Um, but first, they got to get through a, two or three rounds here. And we're going to see who's making it into the finals tonight. So make sure you vote correctly once again. Exclamation vote space one for the unspoken truth. Producer number one or exclamation vote space two for Kane Caleb. Producer number two. As we move our way on down, one step closer to the finals, one step closer to the bag. That's what beat economy is all about, getting the bag. It's cool to have a battle, just a battle. And, you know, sometimes we'll do that. We'll just throw battles just for the sake of battling. But the main focus of beat economy is to empower producers to walk away with some money more than they came with. So if you win, then that's what's going to happen for you. 200, 500, or 1,000. One day we might even go beyond 1,000. But for right now, polls are closed, and producer number two, Mr. Kane Caleb, takes the first one, but it's not over yet. We still got another round. We might have another two rounds. So the unspoken truth, uh, second beat, second round, 60 seconds. Let's get it. So that was the second beat from the unspoken truth. Kind of sounded like a serenading beat at the same time beating you over the head. Someone that's trying to serenade you and beat you over the head at the same time. Interesting. I like it though. Different. All right. So that was the unspoken truth. Kane Caleb, 60 seconds. Let's see what you got to say way over across the pond, as they say. 60 seconds. Let's get it. So that is the second beat from Kane Caleb. Really dope. Very melodic. Very, very, you know, vibey. Very vibey. Had a vibe to it. So let's go to the polls and see how this one is going to play out. If this is the end of the road or not for one of the producers in this battle. It might go to a round three. It'd be dope to go to a round three. And uh, never say it's over because we've seen battles that went to four rounds and you never know which way it's going to go. So it could go. it still could go either way. But for right now, polls are open. Exclamation vote space one for the unspoken truth. Bringing that serenading beat you over the head beat. 
Kane Kayla bringing that UK that 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 usual UK fire. So once again, this is Beat Economy 200. Um, we got about 40 seconds left on the polls. This is the top four producers, best of three. One of these producers will be making it into the finals tonight. Um, we got the unspoken truth, Kane Caleb, the man with many styles, and Levy Beats remaining. So let's see how this plays out. Exclamation vote space one for the unspoken truth. Once again, exclamation vote space two for Kane Caleb. And let's see if we go into a round three or we just ended this right here. Shout out to both producers in advance. Whoever wins, whoever doesn't win, you're still both dope. That's what's most important, that you improve in every week, every battle you improve, you bring something doper to the table. And some producers, I can already see in the chat, people are, you know, saying that certain producers in the battle have already stepped up their game. So that's dope to see the pro progression from your own peers. They can see it. So that's a dope thing. Well, for right now, producer number two, Kane Caleb takes it. Shout out to the Unspoken Truth. Keep doing your thing. Keep speaking your truth with the beats. Let the beats do the talking. Let the production do the talking, which I can see you're already doing. So shout out to the Unspoken Truth. Kane Caleb moving on to the finals tonight. A place he's not a stranger to. He's been in the finals quite a few times. He's, he's lost. He's won. He's been all around. He's done it all. So shout out to Kane Caleb. But moving right along, this is the final matchup for round two. One of these two gentlemen's, gentlemen will be a finalist tonight. So we got the man with many styles. He's going to be going up first. This is his first beat from uh, round two, 60 seconds. Let's get it. That sounds like a military beat, like someone's ready to enter a military combat or something like that. It was something something interesting about that. You know, some people saying it's a muddy, kind of muddy. But as I said, it had a military vibe to it. Like if you could imagine a military movie to go into combat, that's that's a muddy sound because you're in a muddy situation. So that actually fits. You know what I mean? So shout out to the man with many styles. Let's see what Levy Beats has to say in response to that. This is going to be his first beat for the second round. 60 seconds, let's do it. Alright, so that is the first beat for um Levy Beats. Uh let's see what uh what the polls got to say. The man with many styles is producer number one, exclamation vote space one. Levy Beats is producer number two, exclamation vote space two. 
polls are not open, get your vote in, make sure it counts. And let's see who's making it to the finals tonight. This could be just a straight two beats battle, or it could be a best around uh best of three. We could go to a, a round three. Either way it goes, this is dope. Both producers are coming with it tonight. And uh let's you know, it'd be dope to go to a round three, you know, fight their way to the finals. Um, so it's all good. Got about 30 seconds left on the polls. Right now, it's almost a tie. So make sure you vote correctly. All it takes is one vote to break a tie or to make a tie or whatever the case may be. So exclamation vote space one for the man with many styles. Exclamation vote space two for Levy Beats. Both producers fighting their way through the round. It's almost a tie. So it could go either way at this point. Dope, 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 dope. Three, two, one. Polls are closed and Levy Beach manages to get through. It was almost a tie, but as I said, every single vote counts. So that was enough to get him through the round. Not over yet. The man with many styles. We still got a round two, maybe even a round three. So this is the second beat, second round, 60 seconds. Let's get it. So that was the second beat, second round from the man with many styles. Interesting dialogue happening in the chat. Uh, jump in the, feel free to jump in the dialogue. You know, you guys get to vote. You also get to critique, share your feedback with your fellow producer colleagues. So it's all good. Let's get into Levy Beat, second beat, 60 seconds. Let's do it. So that is the second beat from Levy Beats. We heard 60 seconds from the man with many styles. We heard 60 seconds from Levy Beats. Let's go to the polls and find out is this going to be a clean sweep or are we going to a round three? Either way it goes, one of these two gentlemen will be joining us in the finals. So let's open up the polls. Polls are now open. Vote for the better beat. In your opinion, which producer had the better beat for that round? Exclamation vote space one for the man with many styles and or exclamation vote space two for levy beats once again this is beat economy 200 one of these gentlemen are closer to the bag which is 200 dollars every beat economy which is every thursday is a 200 hundred dollar battle on sundays we have either beat economy 500 or beat economy 1000 this sunday will be beat economy 1000 some of the producers who are in the battle tonight will also be joining us for Beat Economy 1000. We will have three guest judges. Why not 
Millennius White and Two Rude. Um, so they'll be the judges for that. You can observe and offer your critique and talk in the chat, but three judges will be determining the fate of that battle coming up this Sunday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, right here on Twitch. So the polls are now closed, and producer number two takes it. Shout out to Levy Beats. Um, actually, my bad. Producer number one took it. I was reading that incorrectly. The man with many styles got that one. So we go into a round three. My bad. My bad. I was reading that wrong because I, I was actually looking at a vote. Somebody voted number two, but the actual poll was round number one. Well, it was producer number one. So we go into a round three. The man with many styles probably got you nervous for a second, but it's all good. You're still in the race. You're still in the running. Let's do it. Third beat, second round, 60 seconds. Let's get it. One thing you can say for the man with many styles, he is not trying to follow anybody's lane other than his own. So it'll be dope. It's very dope to see that, you know, someone that doesn't get caught up in any wave. Because we know hip-hop goes through a lot of waves. This is the hot thing now. This is the hot thing later. He sticks to his own lane. So like it or not like it, he does him. So shout out to the man with many styles. Levy Beats, let's see what you got to say. Is this going to be the end of the road? Or what's going on? Let's find out. This is the third beat, second round, 60 seconds. Let's get it. So that is the third and final beat from Levy Beats for the second round. Let's find out who's making it to the finals. The, the fate of this round here will determine who's going to be a finalist against Kane Caleb. So let's go to the polls. Exclamation vote space one for the man with many styles. Exclamation vote space two for Levy Beats. Polls are now open. Do the right thing. Vote for the better beat. Whatever you're feeling about those two vibes, put it into the poll. Let's see who uh, who's going to take this one. Um. Yeah, Kane is waiting for y'all in the finals, so let's do it. One of y'all is going to be joining Kane, Caleb, and we're going to see how these finals are going to play out. It's going to be best of three rounds for the finals, so however it goes, it should be a dope final round. Um, 30 seconds left on the poll. Once again, exclamation vote space one for the man with many styles, exclamation vote space two for Levy Beats. Um, it could go either way at this at this point. Still got 20 seconds left.
All right, so the polls are closed, and the man with many styles came back. He was one down. He came back to take the second round, came back to take the third one. So he has enough power to get him through to the finals tonight. And if I ain't mistaken, this might be the first time the man with many styles has battled his way into the finals. So that's dope. Shout out to the man with many styles. He's been in many battles, and it's only right after testing the terrain so many times, you finally make it into the finals. So shout out to the man with many styles. Definitely doing his thing. Shout out to Levy Beats. Um, you took out a monster producer in the first round. So, you know, you, you're definitely doing something right if you can do that. It's not an easy not an easy producer to go up against Lincoln the Crux, but you managed to get by Lincoln the Crux in the first round. So shout out to Levy Beats. Shout out to all the producers tonight. Shout out to Crush. Shout out to Unspoken Truth. Shout out to Uncommon. Kane Caleb, of course. Shout out to the man with many styles, of course. Shout out to Diverse. Shout out to Lincoln the Crux. And shout out to Levy Beats. But in the finals tonight, which we're going to jump right into, is the man with many styles going up against Kane Caleb. So this is a matchup uh, we've never seen before. So this is going to be dope. This is going to be dope. So the first producer up will be uh, Kane Caleb. And uh, we're going to see how it plays out. 60 seconds from Kane Caleb. He is going up first. Let's do it. So Kane Caleb always chopping those beats off right at the exact point. Right when you're in a vibe and just like stops. Like musical chairs. Shit. Alright, so let's get into the man with many styles. 60 seconds. The man with many styles. This is the first beat from the man with many styles. Let's see what you got stashed away for the finals. Let's get it. So that was the opening round for the man with many styles. One of those beats you have to listen very carefully to get the pocket to find out where he was going with it. But it did have a, a resounding vibe underneath all the other instruments that was going on. There was a vibe underneath that was consistent. So that's what I was kind of rocking with. That's that groove underneath everything. So that's the first one. Um, let's see what the polls say. Exclamation vote space one for Kane Caleb. Exclamation vote space two for the man with many styles. Let's see who's taking the first one. 60 seconds on the polls. Polls are now open. Exclamation vote space one for Kane Caleb. Exclamation vote space two for the man with many styles. If you voted too soon, which Zika Rex did, vote again. You want every single vote to count. We don't want a producer to lose just because somebody forgot to vote at the right time or they voted you know, too late or they voted with the wrong space or whatever. Vote correct. Let's make every 
vote count. So the right producer walks home with the bag tonight. That's what it is. Beat Economy 200. One of these producers will be $200 richer than they started off tonight. In a simple two-hour span, simply eight or nine beats, you get the bag. And this is how it's done. Some people work a whole week, Monday to Friday, to earn $200. Either it's dollars or pounds, one whole week of work to make $200. Some people join a battle, bring eight or nine beats, and they earn $200. Simple as that. So polls are now closed, and Kane Caleb takes the first one. But it's not over yet. We still got another round, maybe another two rounds. Let's see what Kane Caleb got for the second last beat of the night. 60 seconds. Let's go. Hey, yo, Kane. Don't blow the speakers, bro. got to prepare for those abrupt endings it's like i'm in the groove of it and i just got to get ready for that abrupt ending but that's how kane does you that's how kane does it that's how the farm does it so uh that was the second last beat from kane caleb chad is feeling it so we're gonna get into the man with many styles this is his second last beat for the night 60 seconds let's see him dip into another chamber See if we're going to go to a round three tonight. So the man with many styles, second last beat for the night. 60 seconds. Let's get it. So that was the second beat from the man with many styles. Got a diverse bunch of chambers, a bunch of a diverse bunch of bags. So he dipped into another one for that one. Let's see what you think on the polls. Let's go to the polls real quick. Let's find out how this is going to play out. So exclamation vote for Kane Caleb exclamation vote space two for the man with many styles. Let's just jump right into the polls. Let's see where it's at. See how y'all feeling about this vote. Producer number one, exclamation, vote, space one. Vote producer number two, exclamation, vote, space two. We're down to the wire. We're down to checks being checked, being cashed, checks being cashed. We're down to the deposits being sent. We're down to the wire in this. So one of these producers has to get the bag. We refuse to leave without somebody getting the bag. That's the way it goes down. So let's vote. And yeah, let's go to a round three. Why not? We got time. Let's do it. They both got one more, more, one more beat in the chamber. So let's do it. If it's gonna go to a round three, let it go to a round three. If it's not, it's not. It's dope either way it goes. Shout out to both producers. Shout out to the man with many styles making his way into the finals tonight. Shout out to Kane Caleb doing his thing as well. Shout out to everybody in the chat who was rocking with us tonight. So, 
producer number one got it. So Kane Caleb takes this one. Um, he is a returning champ. This is actually his fourth win. Uh, so shout out to Kane Caleb. This is actually his fourth win. Uh, only producers that have done that so far is him. So Lincoln the Crux has done a best has done a three peat. Kane Caleb had a three peat. Now he's gone to a four peat. So shout out to Kane Caleb. Shout out to the man with many styles. First time making to the finals. So I hope you got a taste of what it's like to make it to the top two. Want to see more of that. We know it's only a matter of time. You will be getting the bag yourself, getting the win. So just keep improving. Keep doing what you're doing. Stay original. Stay you. Stay unique. You got a former champ in the building, Benny D, um, who's been in the live battles in front of everybody, hundreds of people. And he's, he's shouting you out. So stick to what you're doing, the man with many styles. Keep doing what you're doing. But right now, it's mine like Kane Caleb, the farm from over in the UK, in it. Doing his thing once again, taking the four piece sh uh, s salute. Shout out. I'm mixing the two words up. Shout out and salute. Salute. Kane Caleb doing it once again. So, what we're going to do, just to pay respect to both producers, we're actually going to play the final beat that the man with many styles had. And then we're going to play the final beat that Kane Caleb had, just to give you a taste of what the finalists both had in, in the stash. So, give Kane his propers. Give Kane his propers. But let's hear what the man with many styles had in the stash had it gone to around three. 60 seconds. Let's get it. And then we'll get into Kane's final beat. So that was the final beat from the man with money styles. Had we gone to a round three, that's what you would have heard. So let's go to Kane Caleb, the winner of tonight. He actually labeled the beat Daniel Caesar. So I'm expecting a dope San Daniel Caesar flip in this beat of some sort. So let's see what the final beat from Kane Caleb has in store for us tonight. 60 seconds. Let's hear from the champ. That's all you get from Kane Caleb, that Daniel Caesar flip. Shout out to Daniel Caesar. Shout out to Kane Caleb. So once again, um, yes, this is Beat Economy 200. People are asking in the chats. We will have different styles of battles. This is just one lane. We will have producers and teams. We will have genres. We'll have remixes. We'll have flip that sample. That's one of the reasons we jumped over to Twitch for now. Um, so stay tuned. We have a lot more in store. Uh, starting with this Saturday, uh, Sunday, we got Beat Economy 1000. But as far as partnerships, we'll do the team battles. We'll do the genre battles. We'll do the flip that sample. We got a lot more in store. We're just getting warmed up with Twitch for right now. And we might even have some other stuff on YouTube as well. We, it's not like we done with YouTube. So stay tuned for all of that. But for right now, shout out to Kane Caleb. Champ, $200 coming his way for the fourth time. 
So he's making a little career out of this. As I tell people all the time, you can get a beat placement. You can sell a beat for 25 bucks online, non-exclusively. Or you could jump in the beat economy and just play eight beats and two hours later walk away with 200 bucks, 500 bucks, 1,000 bucks. That's how it's done here every week. So if you're interested in battling, putting your money where your mouth is, hit us on the website, battleofthebeatmakers.com. Follow us on Instagram at World Beat Battle. Follow us on Twitter at World Beat Battle. Facebook, Battle of the Beatmakers. YouTube, Battle of the Beatmakers TV. Twitch, right where you're at right now. So shout out to all the producers tonight. Crush, The Unspoken Truth, Uncommon, Kane Caleb, The Champ, The Man With Many Styles, Diverse, Lincoln of Crux, Levy Beats. Shout out to everybody. Shout out everybody in the chat. Shout out to ch previous champs, Benny D in the building. Shout out to everybody making suggestions and we're on it. All that stuff you're suggesting in the chats, we are already on it. It's just a matter of time of rolling it out. But we will have team battles, remix battles, flip that sample, genres. We started out with doing genres way, way back in 2005, 6, 7. All of our battles were based on a genre, you know, smooth, you know, party beats and stuff like that. So that's how we started with genres. And then we just flipped it to be in every man for self battle royal style. And that's kind of how you have it now. But... Enough talking. Shout out to Kane Caleb. Shout out to all the producers. Shout out to you in the chat. You made this possible to have another winner get the bag tonight. You just saved, you know, someone who's doing a nine to five job. You might have just saved them from working three days, four days, five days, you know, and just came to a battle and, and won a bag. So that's how we do it every week here. My name is Clifton. We signing off. We're going to sign off with the with the beat that you just heard. And we out like that. Mm -hmm.